Hey guys, it's Cameron here. Um, let me go ahead and say something before I get started. As you guys know, I have I have only made one rant video and throughout my whole YouTube, whatever I'm doing thing. But um, yeah, um, I ca I already renamed my first rant video, and um, it was just rant video one, and then you know the subject what I'm talking about. But I have renamed it to CGK rant video number and then you know the subject so cgk as you guys may or may not know it means cool gamer kid so yeah uh, that's what's going to be at at the title um cgk um uh, rant two three uh so uh playstation 3d display so that's what the rant is about the 3d tv that sony did announce at the 2011 sony press conference so e3 press conference i should say but um yeah um I recently just made a gaming news and I just I taught the the last news I did talk about was the 3D display and I did tell you guys I was gonna make a rant video so let's go ahead and jump on that so I told you guys it's not coming with um, resistance 3 like it was said at E3 it is coming with MotorStorm Apocalypse now that could be a good thing or a bad thing if you like MotorStorm more than the resistance now think about MotorStorm it's an older game well not too old it came out in may but like it's a different genre of you know what we were getting completely and um you know and it's like i said it's kind of old not too old but like resistance 3 it will be like a newer game and, and one that anticipated fall games of this year so of course people are probably not going to buy resistance 3 on release day because they know it's coming with their 3d display now i'm not sure when this 3d display is uh, gonna be released that's one thing i don't like um but well, you know it will be announced soon hopefully at the tokyo game show when we will have more vita information but um yeah no release date yet it does come with you know uh hdmi cord you know the display itself uh a game which used to be resistance 3 but now motor storm apocalypse and um, a one pair of 3D glasses. Now, if you want to buy another pair, it's seventy dollars, which is not bad. It's really good compared to if you're trying to buy, you know, full price glasses for a different brand. Well, besides LG, since they're trying to make them cheap, I think they're like ten dollars a piece. But they're like uh, movie theater glasses. But I'm getting off topic here. But I really don't like the fact that they're doing this. I mean, I'm not a big fan of MotorStorm now. I love the MotorStorm one demo. That's all. I didn't like the full game, but I'm not a big racing fan. The only racing games I do like is Full Auto 2 and Burnout Paradise. Now, I did play MotorStorm Apocalypse demo, and it actually was pretty cool. And, I mean, I kind of wish I had a 3D TV to play it, but I'm not trying to get the full game or anything. I just want to experience it. Now, I'll tell you guys what I'm going to do when I do get this 3D TV, since it's officially said that it is coming with a MotorStorm Apocalypse. Um... I'm gonna, you know, get it, do unboxing for you guys, show you guys the case. Now, I'm not gonna open the game for you guys because I'm gonna sell it. I'm not gonna play that game. I'm sorry. I'm not a fan of that game. I mean, it's kind of a poor choice considering that Resistance is, you know, a popular title and a franchise that's, you know, the third one, third one of the franchises coming out this fall. You know, that's one of the big fall games. But at some of you guys may not believe it's true or not maybe like you might get a choice or maybe they didn't update you know like the you know the the website saying if it like you get a choice between resistance or um motor storm or whatever if there's two different bundles but i will show you uh, tell you guys this not actually show you guys in just a minute but resist it has been said that resistance 3 3d display bundle Replaced by MotorStorm Apocalypse Bundle. Asomniac apologizes. So now I'll show you guys that right here. Yeah, too late. So it is official. Um, do I really don't like that. But um, Asomniac did say on their Twitter page that uh, MotorStorm Apocalypse replaced by Resistance 3. Um, sorry for any inconvenience. Actually, before that says for those who are asking to buy the 3D bundle, 3D TV bundle, whatever. But you guys get the point. But this bundle altogether still runs for 500 bucks. Now there is kind of a bright side to the situation, considering that you know I was really looking forward forward to playing Resistance because I am not buying the game. 
I kind of lost love for Resistance ever since Resistance 2. I loved Resistance 1. I really, really did. And then I got Resistance 2 and it was full crap compared to the first one, at least to me. And then, you know, uh, Resistance 3, it doesn't look all that great. I am one to, you know, try it out. So I, it's a possible chance of renting. I mean, I really lost that much love for it. The online, it just felt, so, the second one just felt so much different from the first one. The, the way you played campaign and the online. And Resistance 3, you know, you can't really judge a game unless you play it. Well, guess what? I have the beta, and it's still full crap toward to me. And even my friend, um, Black Boy One Sixteen, go check out his channel by the way. But getting off topic, a Black Boy One Sixteen, he has the beta too, and it's to him, it's not all that great. And you know, I I, I got him into the PlayStation franchise kinda. I mean, he only got it for Uncharted, to be honest. But you know, I'm trying to get him into other great games that are also on PS3 exclusively. And obviously, Resistance Three didn't do it for him. Obviously, I don't like Resistance anymore. So, so something's up. But that's that could just be us. You guys could be the biggest Resistance fan and still love the franchise. It's just I don't like the franchise. It could be a Somniac. Uh, it's not my taste, I guess, because I really don't like Ratchet and Clank either. I only like Resistance 1, and that's the only game I have liked by them. But um, I think I was talking about a bright side from all, to all this, and let me uh, get into that. Um, pretty much everybody has changed the uh, info for the 3D display to, you know, saying that it does come with Motorstorm Apocalypse. Now, GameStop.com, they do have something very, very interesting. But before I get into that, sorry I keep getting off topic. I mean, this is pretty much kind of the big finale, kind of, I guess. I don't know. But I was getting this on Amazon.com because, you know, basically free shipping. Well, actually, was it free shipping? Basically, I'm a Prime member at the moment. I'm doing a free trial. But basically, I was getting, getting it the next day, not the release date of the, you know, when it does come out. But I didn't really mind. I'm getting from Amazon so I get free shipping I don't have to pay tax I mean it was gonna be awesome not paying like 20 to 30 bucks of tax I don't know how much tax this would be but you know I wasn't trying to pay extra 20 to 50 bucks on the TV for something I'm not you know getting extra stuff for and you know that's why I didn't want to go to GameStop and get it or whatever but I've been buying from Amazon for the pa um, past year or so and I love it so I like buying stuff from Amazon but um, that's kind of a deal breaker now considering what GameStop seems to be doing now they GameStop does have, have the release date for this TV for November 26th hopefully that is not the real release date if it is whatever not um, but um, hopefully that's not it but what GameStop does offer with this PlayStation 3D display bundle is actually I'm just gonna show you guys. Uh, I mean, it's pretty awesome. This the change. This changes everything. This kind of changed the whole ran around. Bonus item: Resistance Three. You know, you see it comes with Motorstorm Apocalypse. Actually, I'm not sure if I showed you guys that picture. Sorry if I didn't. But like I said, 500 bucks. But bonus item: Resistance Three. Now, how do you get this bonus item? You think you just gotta buy it? Actually, you will have to pre-order the item well 3d display to receive a free copy of resistance 3 and this looks pretty official and updated i'm pretty sure this is not a mistake now i will be calling gamestop tomorrow to confirm this with them i'm not sure if they're you know they're really going to tell me if it's true or not or if it's a possible change i mean i don't see uh what the problem would be i mean i guess just ask them but this changes everything if this is true and it stays like this now I, I would I wouldn't mind paying tax and everything since I'm getting a game with it. I mean well the game that was supposed to come with it with it, if you guys know what I mean when I say that, but Motorstorm Apocalypse, Resistance 3 together, I mean that sounds great. I still sell Motorstorm Apocalypse, but probably keep I'm still I'm gonna sell Resistance 3 and I'll tell you guys that in a why now. I'm not gonna sell it right when I get it. I'm gonna play it, beat the campaign. Hopefully there's a two-day trial for online, like usually what online passes have. Since Resistance 3 does have the play, uh, is the first game to have the PlayStation Pass. Hopefully it does have a two-day trial, like the other companies provide for their games that have provide online passes. But if it doesn't, then I just want to play the online. I mean, when I sell it, I want to make sure it's actually in selling condition. Like 
when I say selling conditioning, I mean like ma like make sure the person that gets to nets actually has a chance to play online. Then me just redeeming the codes like, oh, I don't like the online and selling in. They don't get a chance with the online now. They might be able to get the two day trial, but you know they're still gonna need the pass unless they're willing to buy a pass for ten to fifteen bucks. I'm not sure how much Sony will be charging for the PlayStation Network passes, but. You know, I'm not going to let that chance for the next person that owns it after me not be able to play online. But you guys get my point. I was, I would love to play Resistance 3 with this bundle. I really do want to play it. Well, then I guess I will rent it if I don't get it, if it's not included. But, you know, it's just a great bonus with this 3D TV now, Motorstorm Apocalypse. Since it is an older game and I have played the demo for the game. I already had a chance with it. I don't really want to play the full game, but you guys kind of get my point there, hopefully. But um, yeah, that's pretty much about it. I do plan to buy the 3D display still, obviously, since I haven't said I'm not going to. And um, I am gonna try to buy an extra pair of 3D glasses. Like I said, it does cost 70 bucks. So, um, so all that plus tax, because it's 577. Well, at least from Amazon, that's what it was like. I'm still gonna keep my Amazon pre-order just in case they do offer what GameStop offers, but um, I really doubt it since Asomiac apologizes that for the inconvenience, so I'm pretty sure it's official. So hopefully GameStop just keep, keeps this and that would be amazing. But I'm um, sorry this is a long rant video. As you guys know, I kind of suck at keeping my video short. But I just wanted to get my point out there. And I want to know what you guys think. Leave me a video response below. Oh, well, guess below. Just leave me a video response and your comments below. That would be pretty awesome. I don't really get video responses. Actually, I don't at all. But actually, I think I have two. But I'm not, I had nothing to do with what I was talking about. But yeah. But hope you guys enjoyed this second rant video. Hopefully I can get better at, at my timing actually on every video and crap, but whatever. Hope you, got, hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for the support. Comment, rate, and subscribe. And let me guys tell you something real quick. I am about to make one more video after this and it has something to do with the Vita. And I did want to say this. Sony does continue to disappoint me disappoint me with this with the little changes that they're doing with this 3D TV now with the Vita being delayed to uh, early next year for Europe in the US but I will be going over that in my next video so look out for that if you are interested but if not whatever I'll just catch you in my next video thanks for watching again and yeah I'll catch you guys later peace